Now at 5.30, new developments in the thefts of two baby swans. They are back where they belong at Lake Eola, and the person accused of taking them will face the consequences. Good evening, everyone. I'm Ginger Gadsden. So glad you're with us tonight. I'm Matt Austin. It's an update to that story we broke last night on News 6 at 11. News 6's Carolina Cardona has the latest now at 5.30. Rescue him. Stop. They won't be Stop. here tomorrow. Stop. It's the alarming reaction of witnesses as they saw a man grab two baby swans from their parents Sunday evening. I work for the Lake Eola. News 6 first showed you these images last night. In the video, you can hear the man even say he works for Lake Eola. What I really appreciate is people in the park saw what happened. They, they sprung into action. They questioned him. He said he was with our swan volunteers. Our swan volunteers at the lake wear red. He was wearing a red shirt. He was, Im he was impersonating the people that help at the lake. So he knew what he was doing. Today, Orlando police issued an arrest warrant for Richard Newell Harger Sr. and charged him with grand theft third degree. Commissioner Patty Sheehan credited the work done by detectives and the people who recorded the incident. The people that took the video, as well as other video that we have, the witnesses said they would cooperate and they would help convict. In less than 24 hours, Orlando police detectives closed in on the suspect who they say came here to Lake Eola in broad daylight and took two of the most expensive animals at the park. The family is all reunited now and they're being closely monitored at a secure place of the park. Now we have to reunite the parents with the babies and make sure they don't reject them or attack them or think that they're from somewhere else because swans are very territorial. According to police, the 71 year old used a red cooler to keep the parents away from their babies and then placed the babies inside the cooler. This guy really disrupted the swans entire activity. And what's really frustrating is what the swans do is they sit on the nest and they take turns, the mother and the father, um, because he waited until they were exhausted and dehydrated, hit him with the cooler and then stole the babies. On Monday, a detective arrived at Newell Harger's home in the Avalon Park neighborhood of Orlando. The police report states the birds were inside a laundry bin and Harger handed them to the detective. When asked if they were the same ones taken from Lake Yola, the suspect replied they were. Authorities indicated the baby Hooper swans are valued at $5,000. Well, this wasn't just some random thing where he scooped up a couple. He knew what he was taking. He knew he was taking the rare, one of the rarest breeds we have. In Orlando, Carolina Cardona, News 6.